Hello, 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 pickles. It is Saturday. And yesterday I spent the day braiding my sister's hair. And by the day, I meant a couple hours and then I got tired and laid down for the rest of the day. Again, my back hurts. So it's definitely been a interesting couple of days. You know, I have a baby, so I got to carry her around and whatnot and still be a mom, even if my back hurts. I'm gonna get some natural lighting going in here because I, I don't have my camera lighting out and whatnot. And it's not sunny at all right now, so it's just a very glum looking day. However, today's very promising. My sister's supposed to be coming back over. I'm gonna wash her hair. Mm. And uh, my Jasmine's grandpa on her dad's side. So my father-in-law has some gifts for Jasmine as well as a uh, Jasmine's great grandma on Nick's side has some gifts for her. So we're gonna go see Mima. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna go see Mike. Yeah. Yay! Yay! So we're gonna be having a good time there. Jazz is just watching her TV, doing what Jazz do. I am, you know, the house is a mess. Nick wants to clean up, tidy up the house before we go over to his dad's, which is fine. Um, I'm probably not gonna vlog that part or anything crazy. But uh, yeah, maybe, maybe. Nick's dad's sister's there too. She likes watching Jasmine. Maybe she'll want to watch Jasmine for a couple hours. I don't know. The day is very unknown at this point. All I know is that my sister's probably going to come over soon. I may vlog a small bit of that. But uh, yeah, today's a vlog kind of day. I'm making tuna right now. I've got some tuna all stirred up. I just need to add some eggs boiled. So I'm about to throw some eggs in the boiler. Right now. Okay, pickles. So, Sydney be keeps coming up with girl names for this unknown child that she wants to adopt and then I keep coming up with boy names but I I think it's gonna be a boy I think she needs to start finding boy names cuz y'all put put names in the comments cuz she doesn't know what the what, what she's that she wants either this filming without like <laughs> stuff is like not fun but I didn't feel like carrying everything around. So, I'll grab my eggs. Quiet down, girl. Get my eggs. I have three eggs in here left, luckily. That's exactly how many eggs I need, Pickles. So, look, I committed. These are like the mixed race pickles, relish. Anyway, I almost cracked. Jasmine! Shh. I almost cracked this into the boiling water. I just need to drop it in. So I'm gonna grab my egg dropper, which is just a regular spoon and drop it in the boiling water. One, did I already add salt? No, I need to add some salt. Two, and three. Three eggs in for some good times. Salt it. Salt the boiling water a little bit. I don't know what salt does for boiling water, but I sure be salting it. Anyways, the uh, tuna is pretty well done. Aside from that, I need to taste it, but I'm not gonna taste it till I add the eggs. So I'm going to put everything away. Trash. Or recycle, which I need to go around and recycle that. Um, this stuff can go trash. <sighs> Throws away entire thing of tuna. Shout out to you if you uh, get the reference. But all right, guys, I'm just going to be putting everything away now. And Nick and I are watching 90 Day Fiance on Prime. So I'm going to take a small break to watch that while these eggs here boil. And we'll be good to go. I don't plan to have a long vlog today. Normally, my vlogs are a little, my vlog to the V. A little bit long, but I don't know. Like I said, my back is hurting, so I haven't been doing much this week. I feel bad. I know I have a live schedule up, and I should stick to the live schedule, but if I'm hurting or tired, I can't go live. But if I do go live, the live schedule is what I'll use to know exactly what time. Yeah, and I'll keep you posted on that, Jazz. So anyways... We are watching 90 Day Fiance. Say hello to Nikki. Nikki, bye. Mwah. 
All right, we're gonna wait on those eggs to boil pickles and then we will be cracking. Hey girl. What? What? Take control. Get your finger off the camera. Move your finger. Your finger's on the camera. Oh my gosh, Jasmine. Look how dirty you made the camera. Okay. What? Okay. Go ahead. You're not doing it right. <laughs> Anyway, I'm setting a 10 minute timer for the eggs and uh, I need to do some laundry as well. Laundry day, don't ask me why there's an open umbrella in the house. If you have a kid, you know that babies like everything except their toys. I'm gonna close that in a second, but uh, I gotta run a cycle and I'll see y'all on the flip. So the tuna is pretty much done. I already got the eggs from out of the boiler. I'm saying boiler like it's not just boiling water in a pot. Anyways, guys, I boiled the eggs and then I've uh, scraped them into a, you know how eggs do. All you got to do is put the uh, boiling egg in a bowl under some cold water. And voila, we got some boiled eggs in the tuna. I'm going to cut up the eggs into the tuna. That is the next step. Sorry, this is such a raw vlog. I didn't feel like carrying around the stuff. Hey, Miss Ma'am, you're gonna need to calm it down before I put you in the electric chair, okay? Say something else. That attitude is not gonna fly, Miss Ma'am. Y'all see how she demands things? Like, I don't know where she got this attitude from, yo. Completely disrespectful. No class. Rude. But anyhowsies, I'm just cutting up this egg, y'all. There's no special way to cut up the egg in tuna because it's all going to look like vomit at the end of the day. So just cut up the egg, yo. I'm doing what I got to do here. Jasmine, you will get some tuna. She's obsessed. You know, she's the one demanding for me to make this tuna. She got me working day and night to the bone, y'all. No sleep. No eats. She's a hard boss. She'll ride you. I can't, not even for a schmeckle. Here I go. Maybe she'll be, maybe she'll have some gratitude when she's, when she's audible, you know what I'm saying? When she's not so unintelligible. Am I right, Jazz, or am I right? <laughs> okay, girl. So I'm cutting up this egg, yo, and it, it, and it is just falling apart on the plate. I'm about to give y'all a visual. You don't want too big of chunks because some people don't like eggs that much. So you want to make sure the egg can hide in the tuna. But for those who do like egg, maybe chunk it up. Chunk, chunk, chunk it up. Jasmine, you said you wanted the organic eggs? Yeah, girl, I'm not. I don't know what kind of wallet you think I got, but no. So... 
eggs cut up. This is also a great source of protein, y'all, these eggs. So uh, if you like a hard boiled egg, salt it a little bit, pepper it, and that's a great breakfast. I remember when I used to love a good boiled egg. So I'm gonna just use this knife. I used to cut them and slice, slide them off the plate, you feel me? And yes, I do have a cutting board. I'm just gonna put the crackers and tuna on this plate anyway, so might as well, right? I'm gonna give it a good mixy poo, mixy poo, mixy poo. Yes, I'm mixing it with the knife. I'm not a fancy person, y'all. Try to tell you. I'm not fancy. I don't have all the right tools for all the right meals. It's called getting by. <laughs> it's called getting by. Anyways, I'm just mixing up the tuna. And the tuna looks great. Like, I just want to dive into it right now. However, because the eggs were boiled, it made the tuna warm. And I like a good, cold, crispy tuna. So, here's the look on the tuna. Don't want to drop the cell in there. But it all looks good. Some people were asking me why my dogs are chained up. It's because they're scoundrels. They're absolute scoundrels and they know it. So don't ask questions. You see, you see this yard? You know why it looks like a tornado? Because these scoundrels, these scoundrels are the reason. Now we um, are budgeting to get them a better situation. So don't worry about that. Dog situation is being taken care of. If you've actually been following my first ever, ever vlog, like, before I even started vlogging, y'all already know. Because in that vlog, we set up the dog kennel. But they trashed it. So, yeah, they're tied up. <laughs> Anyways, y'all. I know from the outside looking in, I look like a crazy. But I'm not a crazy, I assure you. I'm a loony. A loony tick. I'm going to throw this tune in the fridge and move on. We on the way to lay down. We on the way Oop, to lay down. Here we go. <laughs> Boom. Umbrella. Faster than you. I gotta get her bottle. Nick leaves dirty diapers on the couch. Trash can is right there, buddy. Anyway, I got the bottle. She'll stop crying now. Vlogging, mommy's vlogging. I'd love to give you the camera. You don't know what you're doing. I don't want to give you a chance without some insurance. What? What do you have to offer? Miss Ma'am, how about this? I say you give me 10 kisses. 10 kisses if you don't get some good footage. What do y'all think? Is that fair? Give me some good footage, bro. You owe me 10 kisses. And I want, I want some down payments. Down payments. It's up to you now. Tell the pickles what you're up to. You have to put your face in the vlog. Jasmine, I don't know if they appreciate 
That's called successfully getting away so that your baby doesn't cry when you leave. Make somebody else go in there and deal with the nonsense. That's all for tips and tricks from Sajady. <laughs> my name is just my name, guys. Sajady, it's Sid J, all mixed up in anagram style. So if you didn't know that, now you know. But uh, I'm sure y'all are sick of this no lighting. So let me fix that. Psych. Y'all thought. Nick and I are planning to go over to his dad's with Jasmine to grab some of Jasmine's gifts uh, from his dad and uh, his Mima. Uh, Nick's Mima. Jasmine's great Mima. And, well, Jasmine's Mima in general. She only has one Mima. Anyhow, he's, with that being said, uh, he Mike, Nick's dad, didn't give us a time on when to pull up. So we're just going to pull up whenever we feel comfortable and possibly hit the store, maybe Dollar Tree or something. I want some snacks, maybe some candy, and I know Nick wants like some catfish or some fish to cook for dinner tonight. Um, regardless, uh, we do have, um, we did have breakfast already. We had breakfast at six in the morning because we woke up super early for some reason. Well, the reason being Jasmine had no pants on. <laughs> she didn't have any pants on and she was just walking around in the crib. Thank God there was no wet spots in the crib or no flying poops or anything like that. It was just her laying there it looks like she had just woken up when we checked on her and the diaper was like on the the dresser in there so she's a whole character but we moved past that i went and made some breakfast eggs with some bell peppers onions and some bacon in them and then i put some turkey bacon on the side with muffins and a couple of french fries uh so that was pretty good and then second breakfast y'all already saw i obviously didn't film the first part because it was six in the morning and i was already tired as it is Right now, time check, it's 1.54 p.m. And we got a lot to do today. To be honest, I'm mentally trying to combobulate and compartmentalize, but I don't want to get too overwhelmed before the live. I need to do like an earlier live stream today. Uh, just depends on when we get back from Pop Pop's house. Oh! <laughs> anyway, um, let's see what else the day has for us. Jasmine's TV still on, so I guess I can turn that off now. The living room looks like a tornado hit it, so... Ugh. That could be something to do. Get some of the natural lighting in here. And do what we need to do. Okay, lights, camera. I guess I can give you all the perspective of this baby stroller. How do y'all feel about that? Being in a baby stroller. Oh goodness, that's not gonna work. I guess I could do this. Oh Lord, see with the equipment, I can just set it up anywhere. You know what, I've got it. I'll set y'all up right here. Oh, boom. Yeah, this ain't gonna work. This ain't gonna work. Well, Nick's gonna go out in the backyard and pick up all the trash out there that he can. It's a little cold and wet, it just rained and whatever. So he's he's on to the uh, manly outdoor duties. I'm just kidding, gender roles don't exist. We are going to be in here, Pickles, cleaning up the living room. It's not too, too bad. We're gonna fold all these blankets and uh, pretty much make it look like there's not a baby in here at all times. So let's get it done. This is my Christmas gift from Nick, pretty much for Nick though. I'm wearing shorts, so don't worry y'all. Um, yeah, I just fell asleep in this. I need to put on my necklace. I need to have Nick put it on after we finish cleaning, but 
I didn't go live yesterday. Today's Saturday. Again, I have not been sticking to schedule because my freaking back. And I hate when y'all are like, girl, I see you moving right now. Don't tell me about no back troubles. And I know y'all are kidding, obviously. But I'm just saying, I would definitely go live if I could, y'all. And it sucks because I have y'all to be responsible for. I have Jasmine to be responsible for. And myself, most of all. So it's just, it's frustrating when you can't do everything you want to do just because your back controls like 99% of your abilities. <laughs> so yeah. Anyhow, I'm just getting all this stuff done. Folded up looking nice so we can have a nice old day. My sister canceled on me. She said uh, her stomach was hurting, so I will just see her soon, probably tomorrow instead. I'm gonna throw all this in the laundry here. Pick up this pillow. Pillows go under the couch in this room for quick and easy access. Quick and easy access, boom. And I will take this all to the laundry room where Jasmine dwells. The beast. And some open crackers I just found. I just opened a new bag. Looking for this bag. Y'all see how disorganized I am? Like, my live streams are exactly like my life. Chaotic. So, moving stuff around, throwing stuff away. Oh my gosh, I'm stepping in like every type of food imaginable on this ground. I need to sweep. <sighs> I'm gonna dump this in the laundry machine. Wow, y'all should see this floor. <laughs> this is atrocious. I'm gonna just give you a little sneak peek. All these crumbs and whatnot, my pile's right here. Anyways, let me finish piling up this, this mess in it. Sweep, sweep. Crunch my abdomen so that my back doesn't hurt. I still need to do my stretches for today as well, y'all. <sighs> Every time I tell Nick to rub my back, he just rubs it to tickle me and it's so annoying. I'm like, bro. Like, we do have a back massage, absolutely. But it doesn't get in the perfect spot to where my back hurts. Like, it's more like a leisurely back massager rather than like a get a specific area of back massager, it's right here. So I'm like, Nick, rub my back. And he's like, yeah. And then he starts rubbing it so hard and aggressively that I'm like squirming and can't say so. And I'm like, rub it softer. Then he rubs it too soft to where I'm not getting any pleasure other than skin to skin contact. And I'm like, you're so annoying. This is why I should break up with you, <laughs> literally. But it's all good. <sighs> so. That half of the room is swept up. Now for this side, I'm getting like further and further away from the camera. Normally I change the camera angle, but I'm getting so good into this sweeping, I'll just use my teleportation powers. Teleportation. Teleportation. Boom. I bet you Pickles didn't see that coming. I'm also a wizard. Okay. So, once I finish up this side of the room, I will be free from responsibility. I'm trying to keep it tight in the glutes. Keep it tight in the glutes. Sir, that's that pile, and I 
think we have a winner, folks. Okay, Nick's still out there getting the Trizity Ash off the uh, backyard. Let's see what Nick's up to. I love you. Now freeze to death. Anyways, I'm Audi 5000. Jazz is doing good. I gave her a cracker to calm her down, but yeah, we've opened a couple of the Christmas gifts, not gonna lie. But we are adults and Jasmine is not gonna remember this Christmas. Unless you're watching this as an adult Jasmine in several years, or even as a preteen or youngster. You don't understand anything right now. I hope you've progressed. Anyhow, I love the Christmas vibe, the Christmas spirit. Y'all already know I have to show off the tree every time. Got this tree on the side of the road during those bulk pickup seasons. My mom gave me some of these box ornaments that we folded together when I was younger. This one's one of my favorites. Oh my God. This one's one of my favorites. Anyway, we had some pictures of Nick on here, but Jasmine ripped them off and ran away with them. We got the trash man back from his journey. Going to throw it in the trash in the front yard. Well, Pickles. Oh, yeah, we got this Christmas spirit, too. Whoop. So we're having quite the day. What's up, Pickles? It's this morning, Jasmine woke up without diaper on and it was pretty funny because I don't know how long she just had the diaper and wasn't wearing the diaper and there was a bunch of wipes in there all over the place which I gotta clean up but yeah now I'm just playing video games and watching 90 Day Fiance waiting for uh, Sydney to play Fortnite with me because I know she wants to get a dub again we ain't been getting dubs. We've been we've been lacking in the Fortnite department. Cause of her, she doesn't listen on she doesn't get on my mark or nothing. And whenever whenever we get in fights, she just runs away and hides. Except for there's a couple times, a couple matches where we did pretty good. But we be getting second place too often.
I found a third roll of crackers <laughs> in my bedroom because Nick was just eating some. So I'm gonna put all those crackers together in the box. But in the meantime, I changed my fit so I can do my back stretches and not flash y'all during this vlog. Nick is going to bless me with my Christmas present necklace, my necklace that's his birthstone, color aquamarine. So go on and put it on me, honey. Honey buns. I was about to call him in here to, to do this and he's like, I haven't put your necklace on you yet. And I'm like, oh my gosh, you stay reading my mind. So mm -hmm. I am about to be blessed with the necklace. Lift your bonnet up. Ooh. Thank you so much, baby. Mm. I feel like a pretty princess now. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now I'm gonna stretch out my back pickles because y'all already know what time it is. Back stretching time, so. I got y'all all set up with the best perspective in the house. So if y'all were with me during my first back stretch sesh, y'all already know what it is. You gotta put your knee against the wall and angle your foot up pretty straight, as straight as possible. And then you wanna bring your other foot around. And once you bring your other foot around, you want to keep it parallel and then just hold it right here. And then once you feel comfortable and stretched out, you want to just bring it up a bit. You're going to feel it like down here and right here. Those thighs, and then bring it close, bring your back closer to the wall as much as possible. Whew, almost fell. It's because I'm trying to face y'all and show y'all, but I need to face forward. So I'm gonna make my feet 90 degrees, 90 degrees, and then just hold it. Get close to the wall as possible, and then bring it back down. And then slowly bring that foot from behind. And now I'm gonna bring this foot back towards the wall, knee on the ground, towards the wall, on the wall. And then bring my foot around, 90 degrees. Make sure my foot's parallel, upwards. And once I feel nice and loose in my hammy, I'm gonna bring it up a bit. Take a couple deep breaths. Straighten out, straighten up, and bring it back. And just hold it, try to bring it as close to the wall as I can, bring my butt and back as close to the wall as possible. Okay, I'm feeling loose. Gotta let that go by coming down again and slowly releasing. Okay, and while I was over here stretching, I just realized how dirty it is, so I gotta sweep. Now that we have some clean floor, I am gonna do dead bug, which is, ugh. <coughs> excuse me, I lay flat, <coughs> I lay flat on the ground, on my back, straight legs out, arms out, and then opposite leg up, opposite arm up. But you want to start off hovering, hovering arms and hovering ankles. Keep that core tight and just switch. 
Tighten the booty cheeks. Just eat like a cockroach dying. Bed bug. I'm done. This is a workout. Try to keep parallel. All right, I'm done. Oh God, my back. Oh man. This is to work out the muscles in my back. Right here in the kind of middle, long range, up and down. I'm doing it. I'm trying. I'll do it in this direction now so y'all can see how my feet go. So, just gonna relax another second. It's like when the gym teacher counts down 10, 9, 8, while well, your coach really, 7, 6, and try to catch every breath you can before you gotta start again. You gotta hold it back. Just go dead bug. Opposite. Nope, nope, nope. I'm tired. I'm hurting. I'm tired. Y'all get the gist. Oh, my goodness. My core is in pain. Sorry about the covering up the camera. I literally just dropped this entire trash can on the ground. Oh my God. Ah! This is where I put all the stuff I swept, bro. I'm gonna kill the gods. Literally right after I put the broom away. Right after I put the broom away. Y'all wonder why I don't be going live. You see how low this makes my morale? <laughs> Shoot. This has me one call away from the psychiatric ward pool. Like, why did it have to fall like that? This freaking wet diapers coming out. It's ridiculous. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Y'all don't even get to see this. Look at that. Uh, 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 oh God, uh, it's, oh God, no, it's all Jasmine, everything, everything here just screams Jasmine. Okay guys, we're back to square one. I'm gonna throw this full bag away because y'all know how that goes. Y'all can come with me. That was atrocious. The trash is trashed. The dogs are dogging. Kitty patoots. <sighs> okay. Well, that is all I have for y'all right now, Pickles. Um, morale is low. <laughs> Put morale is low if you got this far in the video in the comment section. Put morale is low in the comment section. I am so done, y'all. <laughs> like, I cannot believe I just freaking dropped that whole dustpan or trash can. Nick laughed at me when I told him. I came in the room and I was like, guess what I did? And then he just laughed at me. Didn't console me or hug me or... I was traumatized by that, as y'all clearly saw. 
But anyways, um, the vlog is pretty much over at this point. I just wanted to remind you guys that I cannot go live on my main account um, on TikTok. So JD ASMR with three R's. Again, all the information is in the bio if you want to check that out. This is just me summarizing it. My backup account is to JD ASMRing and my backup backup account is to JD ASMR R with two R's. So yes, hopefully I'll notate that. Make sure to subscribe if you're not subscribed already. And I hope y'all guys, y'all guys, <laughs> I hope the, the pickles enjoyed the vlog. We always have a good time here. I didn't intend on the vlog to be this long, but it ended up being this long. So I hope you guys enjoyed overall. I definitely have more stuff coming up for y'all and I gotta film some videos before Monday comes because I've got nothing filmed for y'all. Peace out.